So right before I started recording this, I found out that we are not going to be able to go back to school this school year, and that had me feeling very sad. So I was thinking of my favorite parts of our school day together, and one of the things that I really love doing with every single one of you is baking. We did some baking projects, some different snack projects, and it was a lot of fun, and I felt like a lot of you enjoyed that. So, my story for today is about something that we can bake. And in a following video, I am going to have a little baking video where I make muffins. And I hope that maybe you guys can make muffins with me as I go through the video. But first, I want to read this story. This story is called, If You Give a Moose a Muffin. And I know in class we read If You Give a Pig a Pancake, and after that book we made pancakes. But I thought this would be fun, because I love muffins. If You Give a Moose a Muffin. If You Give a Moose a Muffin, he'll want some jam to go with it. So you'll bring out some of your mother's homemade blackberry jam. When he's finished eating that muffin, he'll want another, and another, and another. When they're all gone, he'll ask you to make more. You'll have to go to the store to get some muffin mix. He'll want to go with you. When he opens the door, he feels how chilly it is, and he'll ask to borrow a sweater. When he puts the sweater on, he'll notice one of the buttons is loose, and he'll ask for a needle and thread. He'll start sewing. The button will remind him of one. The button will remind him of the puppets his grandmother used to make. So he'll ask for some old socks, and he'll make some sock puppets. There's a lot of mess going on here, little pieces of sock flying everywhere. When they're done, he'll want to put on a puppet show. He'll need some cardboard and paint. Then he'll ask you to help make the scenery. Looks like they're using paint brushes and paints, and they have music going. Maybe this moose is dancing. When the scenery is finished, he'll get behind the couch, but his antlers will stick out. So he'll ask for something to cover them up. You'll bring him a sheet from your bed. When he sees the sheet, he'll remember he wants to be a ghost for Halloween. He'll try it on and shout, <gasps> Boo! I'll scare him so much, he'll knock over the paints. So, he'll use the sheet to clean up the mess. Then, he'll ask you for some soap to wash it out. He'll probably want to hang the sheet up to dry. He'll go outside to put it on the clothesline. When he's out in the yard, he'll see your mother's blackberry bushes. What is that going to remind him of? Hmm, blackberries. Seeing the blackberries will remind him of her blackberry jam. He'll probably ask you for some. And chances are... If you give him the jam, what is he going to ask for again? He'll want a muffin to go with it. So next, I'm going to take you into my kitchen, 
and I'm going to show you some ingredients to make some delicious muffins. We'll see you soon.